Hey guys, I'm back from vacation, so this video is a little bit late, but here we go. This is a quick look ahead at the events for the week to come, starting the week of March 28th. This is the first week of the Easter event, and as you can see, there's kind of a lot to it, so let's get into it. All right, so the idle currency is, let's see if I can get one. The idle currency is this flower, and let's, well, I'll go into that after. So let's start with the regular event. It is wheel week, nothing special here. It's always just the same. And then there's going to be Lorelei and Monkey King in the Soul Shop. Lorelei is 5,000, 8,000 for Monkey King. Both of these are easy passes, as neither of them are any good at all in the current meta. Uh, Lorelei did recently get a, an upgrade to Platinum 3, but I don't think it's going to make her useful, so just kind of forget about her. All right, so we are going to go into Easter. This is a two-week event, so any numbers that I give you now are going to be not complete, and we will have more things coming week two, as we already know there's an item specific for week two that you can get, and nope, we don't know what it does yet. So, we start with the flowers. This is the weekly card where you get eight times your level in gems, and then you can choose gold or purple. This is $20 for 1,500 currency. It's a very good deal for gems if you need them, and it's a pretty solid deal for currency as well. You also get a one-time free package with 200 flowers and five eyes. And there is a daily check-in. So your first day is this, ice, this nice little Easter egg frame. I really do like how they have these animated frames now. They're a lot more fun to look at. <clears throat> so this is a 12-day login, and you do get, uh, what is it, 800 flowers over the course of the thing, plus one of these boss scrolls. Oh, there is 42 of these. So let me change that real quick. 42 boss hits. We'll say we're going to up the numbers by 100. Okay. So, as you can see, you check in every day, you get 800 currency, you also get a nice Heaven and Hell 6-star six six star fodder and some Phoenix Stones and, you know, all that other nice free stuff. This is the event itself, so what you're doing is you are trading 100 or 1,000 flowers at a time for these chocolate rabbits. It's a flat 15% crit rate no matter how what you do, and your progress rewards are eyes, uh, diamond key, 10 cubes six star elite chest and 120 gets you two crystals but you're probably barely even going to reach this one all right so your shop looks like this where you have 120 for the armor and amulet 110 for both crowns and axe 100 for hourglass and chains 95 for ragnarok tears of the goddess all these other ones for 80 85 you've got the 88 percent artifacts here for 65 each missing cleric i don't know why they keep making it uneven like that but okay and you have your red can at 50 cosmic crystal at 60 and all the rest of the other nonsense all right so next we have quests so this one is going to be logging in daily 14 times 10 points each i already missed one on this because well whatever uh this one's 40 daily activity points 10 points 14 times this one's six star tavern 15 points five times this one's seven star tavern 30 flowers five times this is hit a guild boss twice uh there's 10 points 10 times this is buy from the shop twice 20 points five times this is use this might i think this is gems but it might be gold souls i'm not a i'm not really sure but it's used 500 of them 10 10 points 10 times okay Let me, let's look very quickly i always I always kind of mess this up. Oh, come on. The Chinese server is so laggy. It's like unplayably laggy sometimes. Oh, no. It is Gold Souls. Sorry. So, let me just say Gold Souls. Okay. So, it's used 500 Gold Souls, 10 points, 50 times? No, 10 times. That is that one. This one is used 10 Miracle Eyes. 30 points 30 times 
use 10 wheel 10 points 50 times use 10 keys 10 points 50 times because this is a two week event it's going to span wheel and miracle eyes so realistically you can get the 500 points for spinning the wheel and 900 points for pulling miracle eyes but the keys would be um overkill unless you just really like throwing away keys or something like that there's no real need to do that uh, next we have an event boss so this is fighting a Juno boss you get three free hits a day so that's 36 hits plus one from check-in plus five from a secret treasure so there are 42 hits total each hit you do gets you one of these chests which has a 35 percent chance of currency so we're just gonna say out of 14 hits you can get uh, you're gonna get 1400 currency out of this really no idea what this mallet does it's for week two we'll, we will find out uh, there is a ranking reward so if you can place top 10 1500 top 100 it's 500 i'm not going to include these in the rank in the accounts because honestly where you rank is entirely up to your server and your account and is not the same for everybody so we're just gonna say whatever you get is added on to all my numbers um, also every hit you do as long as you can do where is it six billion damage you can get all of these rewards every single hit that's a crap load of gold actually no the way this looks like is you get all of these once so you get a crap load of gold and purple one time and then every hit after that you're just going to get that rabbit chest or the egg chest flower flower basket it's a flower basket and that so 42 hits total is 1400 currency and we'll use that as my number next we have this is secret treasure so you can see that there are 600 flowers here plus two of these mallets wait why is there two mallets here but you get a hundred from the juno boss oh my god that doesn't even make sense all right i don't understand uh the secret treasure hero is satario and you do get five boss hits from that so if you really think about it, you're spending 8,000 gems for 5,000 gold souls and potentially, I don't know, 150, 200 event currency because Satario, he's not good right now. So this one is very, very expensive if you think about it, but we do really need the, uh, oh my gosh, I have this wrong. Uh, we do really, really need the gold souls, so, you know, buy it if you can afford it. <clears throat> all right so again i don't know why you get two mallets when you get a hundred from the boss that's just stupid all right next we have this this is rewards based on how many vip points you earn it does not look like you get double vip this event so this one's kind of a scam but everybody gets this one you can buy a five star for 250 gems and then if you spend a bunch of money you can get all of this other stuff but we're not going to count that either all right, so that is the entire event. So basically, we're going to go with 120 per day idle for 14 days. That's 1,680. You get 200 one time. You get 800 from check-in. If you don't pull eyes, keys, wheel, you get 805 points from quests. Secret, <coughs> Secret treasure is 600. 42 boss hits should give you about 1,400. So if you count that, you get about 5,400. If you pull eyes, that's another 900. If you pull wheel, that's another 500. And we're gonna have to see what happens in week two, plus the boss ranking and so on and so forth. Um, as a reminder, the boss is only 12 days, not 14 days. So if you forget to hit on the last couple of days, you will lose the boss forever. So try to remember to do your hits as often as possible and not leave them until the last moment and possibly forget. All right, so that's the regu that's the regular Easter event. The next week is going to be Miracle Eyes. Nothing special here. Heroic Ruins is going to be Lorelei. And it looks like we're going to have Axe and Tears of the Goddess and I in Moonstones. So if you are able to save up your Moonstones, this is definitely where you should be using them. All right, that is all for this week. See you guys next week.